What's up guys, welcome to a uh, new episode of Fully Modded, um, business update, uh, Turismo R Grotti, Turismo R in a super category, um, I am outside Michael's garage, that is where you can get it for free um, in offline mode if you wanted to try it before you wasted the 500,000 online, give you a little spin of it now, usually in Fully Modded I go straight into the garage and don't do too much with it, but um, I'm going to take a, a little detour with this uh, just to show you a little bit more um, a little bit more footage of it standard um, so you get an idea of actually how quick this car is um, it's definitely up there with an entity when it is fully modded um, but I will let you be the decider of that also leave a comment down below and let me know what you think of this car what the looks are based off um, and uh, that will be that will be greatly appreciated because I said in a previous episode before, and I say it in all the episodes that I do, people are like, no, this car's not based off this. I go from the GTA wiki, which basically is like the root of the game. Um, that is what them cars are based off. So I'm not going to go off that anymore. I'm going to leave it down to you guys to let me know what you think the car is based off. Um, the handling is great on this car, but that's what you expect with these supercars. Um, quick acceleration and all that sort of stuff. Um, but I love this car. I've got it online. It costs 500,000 online um, So I would suggest if you don't have it already I'm a bit late on these videos than I usually am usually I can cover them on the day of release um, But I suggest you you check it out Offline first so you get a better idea of what the cars like and uh, whether you want to spend 500,000 Right, we got 15 mods, so it's all going to be basic stuff. 25,000 for 100% armor. We got brakes, race brakes, engine, level 4, exhaust. We got oval, chrome tip, and race. The race looks really good compared to standard. Yeah, we'll take the race. Um, horn, we'll take the, the new one. Uh, Xeon lights, plate, yellow on black, uh, race brakes. So we got two colors on this. Uh, we're gonna go metallic and we're gonna go something crazy maybe like a let's See what we can do here a do yellow we'll go with do yellow and then we'll go secondary color Metallic and we shall just go from there and see what see what looks good. I'm thinking like a red Let's keep going we'll see what we can do wine red turns it sort of black there we go. I think this is probably going to work. Uh, we'll go with Sunrise Orange. They're probably not the best color coordination, but um, you know we'll just make it look good. Uh, roof. We've got stock roof or painted roof. All right, it looks a little bit better now. We put the painted roof on, so we'll go with that. Uh, spoiler. We got carbon wing and GT wing. We'll take the GT wing. Suspension, competition, transmission, race transmission, turbo, turbo tuning wheels wheel type so we'll stay with a high-end category um, I'm not going to use the wheels that I tend to use too much uh, which is them dash VIP I just love them uh, we'll go with something like um, see the stock wheels ain't too bad to be honest um, see what we got here we go we'll go with them chromatic Z and uh, wheel color will go we can go, yeah, we'll stick with black. Black looks probably better for this. Uh, custom tires, bulletproof, and we'll go yellow tire smoke. Um, windows, limo. So there we have it. Not an awful lot of mods available for this car, but um, when you sort of start buying the supercars and that, that's what you can sort of expect. Um, a little less on the mod front. Um, but that is the Grotti Turismo R. Um, I will take for a little drive so you can see what it's like. Um, now that it is fully modded and you can sort of compare it to the beginning of the video um, which may give you a better idea Let's just zoom out a little bit probably one of the best looking cars in the game so far definitely would have to say it looks a little bit too much like the Pegasi Vaca on the back um, minus the indentation in the middle um, it definitely looks like the Vaca but uh, there we have it. We'll take it for a little drive and then you can see what it is like. Let's get a little bit back. 
Oh, not good. <laughs> Changing over to cinematic. I'm trying to get you some nice shots of the car. There we go. It definitely, definitely is one of the better looking cars in the game. So that is probably the question of this video. Would you rather take this over an entity? Because the entity is probably another one of the good looking cars. I also like the Obey 9F, but that's not really a supercar. It's not really a super supercar like the entity in this. So what would you rather take? The Turismo R or the NAEXF, um, let me know in the comments down below, um, it will be an interesting one to know because they're pretty pretty similar I'd say on um, speed and handling wise, they're really both really good at handling and um, I'm, I haven't really tested speed out much but from driving most of them previously I'd say they're, they're pretty evenly matched um, but as I say leave a comment down below, let me know what you think, the traffic is just playing up for me this video because you know, I'm just trying to give you a little look at what it is like, but we'll leave it there. Um, I've got other ones to do, other cars, um, and usually I do blow the cars up and fully modded, but I'm not going to do them because, as I said um, in a video a while ago, no, I didn't even say it. This is my video that I haven't done in a couple of weeks now. Um, I've just not had a lot of time, so I'll now that I have got a bit of free time, I just want to get as many videos made as I can, so I can go back to getting one up every day. And then I have a load uh, pre-recorded. So there it is. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, feel free to leave a like. Add it to your favourites. Check out some of the other cars that are fully modded. I've pretty much covered quite a lot of the game now. Um, and I will see you in the next video. Cheers for watching.